And now, ladies and gentlemen, I direct your attention to the TV monitors and the finish line. Let's meet eight of the fastest crowns in the country at our richest and most prestigious race ever, the $120,000 Palm Beach Grand Classic. Nominated by the Satin Kennel, running for Satin Kennel, owned by Jerry Hine and trained by Joy Main, is the one Kansas ruler at 73 pounds. Nominated by the Raider Racing Kennel, oh, running for the Raider Racing Kennel, owned by Norman L. Raider, trained by Young Raider, is the two Switzler Jammin, weighing 71 and one half. Number three, nominated by Randy Doubles, running for the B&B Kennel, owned by Lee Dew and trained by A.J. Crawford, is Tommy Commander, 76 pounds. Number four, nominated by the Flying Eagles Kennel, running for Raider Racing, owned by Flying Eagles Kennel, trained by Young Raider, Flying Stanley, 83. Number five, nominated by Steve Schlechter, running for the Mountain Kittle, owned by Christopher J. Darcy, trained by Ron Lees, is Dreamy Blossom, 62 and one half. Number six, nominated by the North Shore Kittle, running for Raider Racing, owned by Michael Labetti and Gary Samuels, trained by Young Raider, is No Booth for Gary, 74 pounds. Number seven, nominated by Patricia B. Byers, running for the Raider Racing Kennel, owned by Michael Labetti and Gary Samuels, trained by Young Raider, is alive for tomorrow, 68 and one half. And rounded out the field at number eight, nominated by Bill Davidson, running for the Bill Davidson Kennel, owned by William T. Davidson, trained by Carolyn Armstrong, is WTD right, right, 60 and one half. Those are the entries and weights for the 12th race, the final and the $120,000 Palm Beach Grand Classic, our richest and most prestigious race ever, post time and one. They're off on the Palm Beach Grand Classic. Two gets the early lead. Switzler jab it. Here comes the six. No booth for Gary. Five on the inside. Dreamy Blossom. Then one, three, seven, four, and eight. As they rush around that first. It is the two Switzler jamming. Here comes the five Dreamy Blossom. Six, no booth for Gary. Then four, one, three, eight, and seven as they head into that final turn. It is the two Switzler jamming. Here comes the five Dreamy Blossom as they round the turn and head for the wire. Two and five go neck and neck. Five Dreamy Blossom close out the wire. Hold all tickets.